The Greater Birmingham Association of Home Builders in D.C. this week trying to put a stop to what they're calling the lumber crisis. We are uh, fighting back against that. I mean, it may not be illegal, but it is wrong, ethically wrong. What's wrong, according to Russ Doyle of Harris Doyle Homes, is how much and how fast these prices are rising. Framing lumber up 300% in the last year. OSB, the wood panels around the home, up nearly 700%. All while the manufacturers have seen significant profits. But what we do have evidence of, based on public company earnings, is the fact that their profits are 300% higher than where they were a year ago. The rising cost of these materials is being passed down to the home buyers. In the Birmingham area, the average price for a new three bedroom, two bath home has gone from about 350000 to 410000 since last year. In most of our communities, we've actually stopped doing pre-sale homes where you come in and write a contract because, quite frankly, we don't know what our costs are going to be. We can't predict if, if the house is going to go up $10,000 in a matter of a week or two. While the cost of lumber continues to rise, Doyle says the American dream could be in jeopardy. My biggest concern with the lumber crisis is the affordability of homes in general. We're trying to keep homes affordable, and it's this is causing them to to be out of reach for many Americans. Now these home builders are waiting and hoping that Congress will intervene. In Shelby County, Sarah Killian, WVTM 13.